This is Rockstar 2800 with Smut Free TV, the hottest content in these internet streets. Make sure you tune in, like, comment, subscribe, get your mind right. Hey, uh, what you know about, uh, you know, Tyrese is going through it with the Pendergrass estate, <laughs> well, with the wife, Tendi Pendergrass. What he did, a, he did a, uh, so I get. So I guess they, I guess he's saying that Teddy Pendergrass gave him the life rights. You know, he was a pallbearer at the funeral as well. But then now the wife is reneging on it, or the wife is not honoring it now that he's dead. So uh, if it ain't on paper, it don't matter. he's suing, he's saying he does have the life. The, his company has the life rights. Yeah, if it's and, on paper, he got it. You know what I'm saying? But I don't I just know. Hope he's he got he the story of Teddy Teddy Pendergrass. Yeah, tell a real story. Huh? Exactly. Yeah, Teddy was getting hit by a transgender. That's how he wrecked. Mm-hmm. That's a whack, man. That's, that's a true. fact. No, it's that's a, a, a true. fact. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's why you think we call him Teddy Tinder ass. I didn't know. I never heard Teddy Tinder ass. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Yes. Go ask that's one of your older homeboys. Like that's what they say. Go ask your mom. Man. I promise you. They this know. is a fact. Everybody knows. Damn. They used to throw panties at that nigga on stage. He gets some hit. Yeah. That's, that's what they said. They said turn out, they said he said turn out the lights or some shit. Man, this shit know. big. <laughs> this shit big going on. This, this, shit. Said, said, this shit. <laughs> this nigga crazy. Man, this shit big going on. <laughs> like Tupac said, but you will not know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> but hold on, Wax. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> that's what he said. Nigga. That's the real last line. It didn't call out. Hey, that's hey, but you hey, that go hey. Listen, some of you ladies, some of you ladies, say y'all can't look at a nigga and say, but you and I know what's going on. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nigga be sitting there, he geared up, he in the bins whole time. She letting him win. Is this all because of her? Nigga, you and I, you could use that all kind of shit. Teddy Tenaz, nigga, they throwing panties. They used to throw panties at this nigga on the stage when he performed. But he go out there and let a man give him some head. So, nigga, you and I know what's going on. The man could tell Teddy Pendergrass, but you and I know what's going on. Some of them kids that was fucking around over there at Wonderland, or whatever you call that shit, could say, I, you and I know what's going on. <laughs> I could say to a bunch of niggas, Nigga, you know you and I know what's going on, boy. You know what you was over here talking about. You know what you was crying about. You know what you was up to, boy. You know. You and I know what's going on. Again, that's against all odds. You ain't never heard that song, Rockstar? Yeah, no, I like that song, but you, you said really it in a different... I, ever wrote. I know, but well, you I got me thinking in a different <laughs> manner now. Hey, back. Okay. Yeah. Because it can be used like that. <laughs> Wack, I don't want to think you about it. I know what's going on. Hey. <laughs> you know I know, know boy. You know I know that you know that I know. We're going to use that. Oh, we both know. He was getting um, um, service when he mm -hmm. fucked the trash. I didn't know he was um, over there. Yeah. <laughs> he was in Transylvania. Okay, cool. <laughs> His wife was so sit Indian style. This shit crazy. That motherfucker sit Indian style and open up that laptop. That motherfucker go to work, boy. I think it was like yeah. he was really dating that person for a while. Yeah, yeah, for real. Why, that yeah, wasn't which no is fling. why it's not like that wasn't no fling, nigga. You you say, oh, I didn't know. No, you knew this oh, bitch. This bitch was. Visiting you at the hospital, you was giving that little Richard vibe. You know what I'm yeah, All like it turns into some bullshit. You knew, nigga. You knew. You the just story should be really good. That. Nigga, nigga got a nut and ran right into the tree. Ooh, but nigga, you see he, what? I can see now why the bitch may not want the story to come out. Look at today's era right now. You know what I'm saying? You feel to be seen right now. As for all these people that don't know, as a woman who was cheated on, you know, by a man who was in some trannies. You know, Ugh, your grandkids, and you know, it ain't like it's the 70s no more, whatever. Fuck that. Well, Rockstar, like. you gotta watch Tyrese, though. Tyrese Absolutely. Slick. That's a watch, nigga. He might be trying to run the play just to put the attention on his, what he about to do. Mm. Yeah, I mean, uh, he, they mentioned his film company. I didn't know he had a film company, Voltron. 
uh, Voltron, I guess Voltron Films or some shit. So, he doing his thing. About to come with something big. If he get the rights to that shit, that's going to be a big movie, though. Get the right I don't know, play. though, bro. I, I don't know because... Not him <clears> acting in like, it. um, what's that movie I said it was too late? Bob Barney, they came with it too late, bro. Man, yeah, they didn't do that good. They should have did that shit 20 years ago. That shit would have went crazy. I think it might be, you know, because the people that know about him, are still they alive. people, right? And they already know the story. <laughs> they know the story, so we like, like you, Rockstar, you, you you just know the name. You like, nigga, you not finna rush to go see no motherfucking Teddy Pendergrass movie. And your woman ain't finna be on that. Nah, nah, that. Bob Marley, when I seen they showed a preview for that, I said they did this shit 20 years too late. 20 years ago, nigga, that roster shit was in demand. It's crazy. So, I don't know. Hmm. Put it like this. The story of, what's that nigga name? Wyam Melly. Melly's story will outrun Teddy Pendergrass story today, right now. It's a fact. And I outrun Teddy because the kids is gonna go support it. Hey, nigga, speaking of nigga Juan W. Melly, nigga, you see this shit, nigga, just happened tonight. The co defendant of Juan W. Boylan was arrested with witness tampering charges following a home raid by law enforcement on Monday evening, October 2nd in Miami, Florida. Bortland, real name Cortland Henry, was booked in the Miami Dade County. On out of county warrant at 10:22 p.m., Boylan was originally slated to begin his trial today, but was rescheduled to January 12, 2024. Last week, Boylan, who is Juan W. Melly co-defendant, has been out on bond with a monitor since August 2021. So, what witness was he fucking with? Man, we don't know. I don't and he's know, out man. on bond, so was it a witness against him? Or was it something they saying? Or YNW. Yeah. It's not looking good. Witness was. <laughs> it's not looking good when they come for witness tampering, though. But it's crazy. I done seen niggas beat that shit in LA, though. It wasn't on no big shit, though. Like, more like some robbery type shit, you know? But. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, Wine W. Melly boy. Yeah, this like this is just cause you know he just got a retrial, right? So this is yeah, I think they retrying the case. Cause it was a mistrial the first time. So it's like with this coming up, it's like, what the fuck? Damn. I mean, they gotta see who the witness was. I mean, maybe cause dude out on ankle monitor. Yeah. So it could have been a motherfucker on his side of it. Mm. On every time. See, man, niggas got. I guess, man, it's whatever. I guess the niggas never learn. You know what I'm saying? At oh, this no, point, no. niggas gonna do nigga shit. Cause it just don't be making sense to me. Whack, like you in a position, you you know you hot, you you can't be right. making certain moves. I just don't be understanding that shit. Sometimes don't add up to me. That whole case is banana. Yeah. Look at all this shit. The case, the song, the fucking... Oh, damn. <laughs> all that shit is fucking... Look, right? That's right. Hey, Shadow Man, this shit out about the IG page. You said they Shadow Man in your shit? Yeah, yeah, my shit been Shadow Man like two years. Like, like, Breaking. right now, a picture I put earlier say I got 10 comments. But if I hit my comments, it's about 100 something, 200 comments. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's, it's like I'll, I'll wake up, it'll be a post that say 300 likes. I'll go to sleep, wake up, and then it'll catch up the next morning. It'll be like 1,000, 1,600, 2,000. Like my shit been like that. It's crazy. Nigga, I'll go three months with no added followers, but every day it's showing me. Six, seven, eight hundred people, new people, right? And then one day it'll just be another seventy thousand followers just pop up on my shit. Mm. 
No, that's shit. Yeah, like, it's like they like, they don't let my shit update every day. I don't know what the you fuck. You probably got so many complaints, nigga. Up the ass. Oh, yeah. They, yeah. You know, they complain on me just for no reason. The, the IG people said, they said one day it was crazy. They had been complaining. You breaking up. You said, IG said, what, what? <clears throat> this nigga shit in and out. You there? You got to switch it up. From his Wi-Fi. Make sure y'all ping up. Shut up, man. My Facebook for saying I was slapping Atomic Dog on Crenshaw. <laughs> I was doing cruelty to animals. Yeah, I stopped playing with that Facebook shit. All that. Even Instagram got sensitive. And you can tell from the analytics, like, it's no fucking way in hell. If you got anything over 10,000 followers, that you got 70 views. Yeah. Like, yeah. Just, everything is sensitive now. No, nah, Instagram killed it, though. They, man, when they start doing all that, uh, you can't put crip in your shit, title, uh, certain shit, they was just on. Like, we, I can't do no weed shit on my shit. I don't know how everybody do their shit. But nigga, every time I put weed or uh, like try to promote something on my story, they flag me. I just got banned. I came back from seven day ban off live on everything. So that shit crazy. Yeah, I can't do no weed stuff. You ain't tapped in with the weed community and see how they can't even, their shit is being like burner and all them. Man, I'll be seeing niggas with big ass pounds, pee. I'll be like, what the fuck is going on? You say you got you ever, on Twitter, on Twitter, you can prop. actually, oh, sorry. On Twitter, you can actually, um, he'll let you advertise for that. You got to put for educational purposes. Yo, I, mean, I was doing that shit too. Like, not for sale. I was doing that shit on my story for a minute. And I'm like, man, then I stopped showing the weed. I just show the packaging. They be tripping off the packaging. No, it's, no, it's because it's you, Rockstar. You smoke they flagged, they flagged all my shit with packaging, bro. It's all that weed that they said you were smoking, bro. You don't remember that? Mm, no, that shit. 